here it is a very nice radical problem so seventh root of 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 is equal to 7 then find the value of x so 7th root of 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 is equal to 7 all right so it can be as we know that if nth root of a is written then it can be write as a to the power 1 over n right so here it will be 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 whole power 1 over 7 is equal to 7 all right so here 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 whole power 1 over 7 and whole power 7 is equal to 7 to the power 7 right as we know that if a to the power m whole power n is written then it can be write as a to the power n whole power n is equal to a to the power m multiplied by n right so here it will be 7 to the power 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 whole power 1 over 7 multiply by 7 is equal to 7 to the power 7 right it will be cancel out so here it will be 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x whole over 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2 is equal to 7 to the power 7 if we cross multiply then it will be 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x is equal to it will be 7 to the power 7 multiply by 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 7 multiply by 7 to the power 2 right so here it will be 7 to the power 16 plus 7 to the power x is equal to 7 to the power 7 multiply by 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 9 because as we know that if a to the power m multiply by a to the power n is written then it can be write as a to the power m plus n because base is same right so here it will be 7 to the power 16 minus 7 to the power 9 is equal to 7 to the power 7 multiply by 7 to the power x minus 7 to the power x right so here if we take common 7 to the power 9 then we get 7 to the power 9 multiply by 7 to the power 7 minus 1 is equal to if we take 7 to the power x common then it will be 7 to the power 7 minus 1 right so here it will be cancel out right so 7 to the power 9 is equal to 7 to the power x so as we know that if a to the power x is equal to a to the power y is written then we can clearly say that x is equal to y because base is same so we can compare the power so here it will be x is equal to 9 and this is our answer thank you friends